Hi, my name is Alex Herman. I'm teacher, engineering teacher at Queen Anne's County High School. And uh, this is my ninth or 10th year here, I believe. Our engineering program offers multiple classes. It begins with introduction to engineering design, then principles of engineering, followed by digital electronics. And then students have a choice of either aerospace engineering or civil engineering. And the last course is the capstone engineering design and development. Um, four of the courses are eligible for college credits. So students can graduate with 12 engineering credits from Rochester Institute of Technology. After school, we have multiple different programs. One thing you can do if you're interested, and we offer this to the public also, you can come in, custom design your own electric guitar. This is something our students have been working on after school as part of the engineering club. My name is uh, Colton Bollinger. Uh, I'm a senior, and my favorite part is the new drone racing team that we have. My name is Carter Winterstein, and my favorite thing about engineering is probably just learning to design more and more things. My name is Alex Vale, and my favorite part of engineering is just getting to build stuff. My name is Isla House, and my favorite part of engineering is working with other people and building stuff. My name is Eli Kurtz, and my favorite part of engineering is uh, coming up with ideas to solve problems. I know that is engineering, but that's my favorite part. We worked in conjunction with a business up in Sudlersville, Harbor Sales. They CNC'd the design that the students made, and a freshman, believe it or not, actually painted the headstock with the lion cub and black-eyed Susan, which is the state flower. Um, Next, we just started offering this this year. We have a drone racing team here at Queen Anne's that's also run through our engineering club. I started the drone racing team here at Queen Anne's County High School. So this has allowed me and some of my peers to uh, get involved with drone racing and learn how it can go even further into a career with uh, things like photography, videography, um, surveying like land, uh, and even in agriculture. We have multiple 3D printers in our building and here are some examples of figurines. The students were approached by the Dungeons and Dragons Club, hey could you make figurines for our club so we can play board games? And so the students did the designs and then printed them themselves. They have to practice working with a customer so they're based on customer designs. If the customer is unhappy of course they have to redo the project. They also have to do pricing analysis so they get budget work in the course as well. So I've been working on this, this is the beginning of a prop for the Beauty and the Beast musical we'll be doing soon. I mainly do a lot of stuff with the 3D printers. Later I'll be working on the actual rose prop itself for the musical as well. Uh, at first I didn't really know what I was going to do and I gave engineering a shot and I really fell in love with it. I just joined uh, IED for just because it said uh, you need Algebra 1 so I was like oh smart people are going to be in here and then I liked engineering so I decided to continue. So the first steps are work really hard in math class. Engineering has mathematics in it. And we also, since I'm a certified math teacher, that helps. It's a lot of extra great practice for practical applications of mathematics. And then all you have to do is tell your guidance counselor you'd like to take a course, and that's it. Again, you can get 12 college credits. It's a phenomenal deal to go through our program. If you're interested in robotics, we have multiple dis different robotics projects that we do as part of the course. Our students have even worked on building after school. They designed a version of the Mars rover, and then during school one day, they drove it around the building during classes to show it off, which, you know, some teachers weren't very happy with me, but overall, everyone was really excited to watch the Clawbot drive around and pick up things and drive all the way back around to, to our classroom. So we do have a lot of fun. And we shoot rockets too.